It's time to test the season for the holiday in the park back for the second time since we are never been in here in the park that long after our drive through last year. So it looks like it's time to make the holiday a spectacle. Let's get to this one for our holiday brand. This is gorgeous. Since coming here from the uh, ultimate of the, the last part of a drive through I guess we are here for our amazing part of holidays in the park. So it looks like we are back in together. And not to tell you this one here, but that set of a tree looks really, really colorful. Really like that one to tell. As you may have already known, I've never been coming back here so far. I was really sad that I could have been here at the holidays in the park, but Finally, I, it's just been a great night to, uh, to get some little pictures in here and also with some uh, little market and entertainment and also, of course, rides. Well, I'm not sure where else to go, but there's a lot of stunts and stuff here. But keep in mind that one of the rides are not open as of this season. Since it's winding down, it's extremely cold. Good thing I'm already good in protection for winter. Yep, I am active at this point. So it's time to see what's going around in the park. Something I did not notice here is that they got a holiday markets up here, whatever you would like to uh, go check it in. And they've got a lot, tons of stuff here at every place is here in the picnic section, including of course the cookies for, for me to have. Even if you're not a Santa cookies here, you may not know what is going to happen, but there's a lot of stuff out there in the market that you're gonna definitely love enjoy it and also have some holiday sweets there's so much to have it in here oh my goodness look at that line that is for to get to santa at the house i mean we don't have to talk about that one here i don't have to take pictures of santa you know i'm going out and here's a very nice uh, good looking decorations over here joy to the world look at that that looks very nice relocating over here it's perfect place right next to those trees over there the maze very cool and I mean this one's part of a Hanukkah over here and Kwanzaa that's pretty neat very nice right next to the tree maze here well first off we're gonna do a little tree maze hmm. I've, I have not seen it in here anyway this is pretty interesting wow look at that that tree looks pretty amazing over here. I mean, we never get to do this as of this year. I mean, there is so much to be honored right down there. Look at that. Just only me and mom doing this. We're in the trees. I mean, have Hi. you been into this maze here before? No, we've never done this before. This is definitely our first time that we've never tried it on here. Cool. And I'm That's gonna cool. tell you this, this is really cool. Interesting to tell, red, white, and green. I mean, I don't know why blue doesn't make sense. Well, blue makes uh, snow. A yeah, that's too. that's definitely a Christmas color. So, uh, if you're thinking of it, that's for Hanukkah. Every holidays are definitely the same. But look at that. It looks very unique. How exciting! Yeah, pretty nice over here. It's definitely amazing to take a look at it. And we're out of here. We made it. Nice bright lights in the metropolitan area. Looking very nice. Red, white, and blue color. Looks very nice in between the cyborg and a nice colorful display. Yeah, I still deserve this Justice League right here. It's still me because I really do really good at it. Not the buzz one because not really well enough. Lasers are really well enough anyway. So I got another one right next to me behind. That's a Wonder Woman over there. So yeah, dad, I beat him. Oh, yeah. yeah. My gun wasn't working right. Yeah. But I but I now figure it out how to use it anyway. Very well done. Very well done for the Just League. Still having the best. That's because I ranked into five. Now I'm in four. Really well to phase out there. <laughs> how amazing is that? Little, little photo out or a video bomb. Got nothing else to say about it. Let's just uh, get the next one. See you all for the next update. Okay, I know what you're thinking. It looks like it's Lasso Truth time. As I pass here for the bridge, and at this point, 
I got lots of things to say that this is a tough spot. Yeah, tough attractions already are including on my list of the thrill rides, but it will be tough to tell which one's the best. So, let's get in the night ride for the Wonder Woman. And I'll see you all next update. Holy, oh my God, that a ride was amazing at nighttime. I'm not gonna lie because this was a close call day and nighttime. I don't know what to tell you with this. With this, oh my goodness, this is very high flying, very fast. That was totally amazing right now. Wonder Woman, Lasso of Truth was a close call in between from Anoratic Outlaw and Wonder Woman. But I will have to rank one of each attractions of the thrill rides of each uh, theme park. It, it doesn't matter. I mean, I have to talk to theme park crazy about this. It's too close to call. Trust me. Ooh, this looks like it's a nice uh, color, uh, color ones on the lights up there. And the Christmas tree is right there, right next to the Gotham City, as I'm up to be heading to Batman, the ride over here. Yep, definitely the next attraction on the list. Let's get in there after this update. See you guys. Nice uh, look up the Christmas tree over here, right by the Batman ride. Batman ride was pretty good so far. In between that one, it was really fast to get in line. Nobody else was waiting outside by the main entrance here of that of the point because um, because it was a lot quieter and we all want to stay warm anyway. I mean, very great job for this ride. Oh, well, looks like we got Jersey Devil over here and we got Nitro. It looks like there's no people in line to get, get into Nitro. I don't even see what's going on, but it may be too much uh, to go from here. I'll have to try to see if it is open or not. But it looks like they're going in. Well, I'll see you all for next update. Wow, the front row seat was blowing my face away from, from this part. I can definitely tell you about one here. There's nobody, nobody in the standby line. It looks like it is not that long to just stand here and wait for like, like for minutes. So it looks like that some of the attractions are, have been complete. Really well done with that one with an nitro on number two spot. I think something's roaring on me. You know what's time for? The number one spot of a roller coaster. Jersey Devil, another major nighttime here. Same thing I did here for Fright Fest. Well, it looks like it may be a tough one, but maybe an excellent, excellent coaster. Not really bad with this line at all. And there's the devil chasing right from the track. I mean, that is insane. Everybody is still can't believe it what is going on over here. So Jersey Devil in a holidays in the park. See you next update. I'm never gonna lie. I'm never gonna lie because this is the ultimate of the best coaster that I have ridden so far since it was really the best coaster to make my choice. So it looks like the tough one is gonna be a near one and I'm gonna say that every element of this one are fantastic. I mean I can't go wrong with the Jersey Devil here. It's still number one. I'm gonna tell you why. It is the best. Best new coaster I have ever experienced riding this one. I guess that's uh, I think a lot of uh, lots of great uh, great elements in this ride. The dive loop and then the uh, G stall. I mean that was really awesome. And a zero G roll right from here. That was pretty amazing. Love this attraction so much. It was a best. Give that one a good list. Pretty gorgeous over here. Just amazing as you can definitely spot on those Christmas lights on trees far back as you might have been looking for or just close up by. I mean, there's definitely a choice in between. You might be seeing far to close up. I mean, you can't go wrong. There's a lot of great, uh, great pictures to have that lights over here. How amazing it is. And there's the poinsettia princess over there, right by the flower trees. And look at that over there. That's a nice, nice flowers in the uh, on this wheel. That's pretty neat. You can definitely can't uh, recall that one. A uh, Ferris wheel, like the big wheel right over here. But look at that. That's a princess we're looking for. How looks sweet. How sweet. 
Oh, this looks colorful over here. Look at that snowflake on the bottom. Look at that. Even though my hand's a little reflecting off here from, from here, looks pretty nice. It is amazing. I like that. Pretty nice uh, to get in here. There's a little uh, nice uh, blue wall uh, archway and get to the snowflake here. Also, we forgot we just passed where Ice King's over there. Just did not realize uh, it was coming by. How nice.
connected, but the gifts you can give each other are more magical than anything from my workshop. Joy and love. With these gifts, all your holiday wishes come true. Now, speaking of this, we just finally just did an amazing uh, Christmas show. That's like a nice tree, colorful ones. Not about squish marshmallows, whatever's. But it looks like another uh, pit of the s'mores to have one if you like to go get yours. And now we got the Joker right behind it. Well, just another couple more and then we are out of here. Because right now it's starting to get cold. It looks like nobody else just came in here to look at Santa. I found a uh, statue here next to us. So let's get this attraction down on number three list. Yeah, I can definitely tell you that one here. That was flipping crazy on this ride because of this one was way wicked than I have felt. I'm not gonna lie about this one. This Joker was definitely giving me craziness off the back of the board. And then with that one over here, getting up the lift hill, I mean, that's a little tilt that you may have just felt. So yeah, once again, I will be doing the uh, top rides of every ranking roller coaster at Six Flags Great Adventure. Don't worry, I will try doing the best thing I can. By the start of next year, I will have a, a look at it in between those, those attractions right here and thrill rides, of course. But nice, uh, nice tree look over here. At that point, you can see trees in the back over there, right by the lake. Yeah, I'm not really sure what to say about it, but it seems really nice to me. Great job for the Joker. <laughs> Look at that, that colorful display up here, just like we walked in here. I mean, wow, definitely. Like a little hidden between, that is amazing. I really, really like it. This is a nice uh, nice tunnel over here that you guys have, have heard of it before, the last drive we were in. Make sure you go ahead and check out the calling card up there. And yes, the trees over here too. I cannot even remember. Pretty much cute train. It looks like it all comes down to this as there is nothing else to see in the back over there as this uh, everything is already uh, just finishing it's up on its way. So yeah, this is where, yep, Superman made flight because Green Lantern is not open. So that'll be our final ride of the attraction. We'll see you all for the next update. Amazing presence, so gorgeous. Well, that's it. Superman was a great ride. So, as being said, it was Battle for Metropolis, Wonder Woman, Batman, Jersey Devil, Nitro, Joker, and definitely, of course, down there is Superman. So that was pretty much fun here at Holidays in the Park. I hope you enjoyed your show or the video, and make sure to subscribe to my channel. We'll have tons more coming up and a drive through. We can't forget about that. So, jolly is to all, a wonderful part of the holidays, and a happy new year to you guys. Peace out, everyone, for a while as the Six Flags Holiday in a Park dial. Hope you have a wonderful rest of the holidays. And this is Son of Feast signing out. See you next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.